Yo, what's going on guys? And welcome back to a brand new Skyblock video. And everybody, we are here on play.vanitymc.co and I am super, super excited for the Skyblock series. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys some of the greatest money-making methods, my personal start, and just the server in general. If you guys end up enjoying the video, a sub and a like would be greatly appreciated. So let's go ahead and hop into it. And we've gone ahead and made our island already. All right, I really like this. I'm currently on Dazzer's Realm, which is actually one of my really good friends. And we made a large Inferno Island, which this is what it looks like. And I'm liking it a lot. It has a really cool house to it. It has a nice chest with some of the normal Skyblock items you'd be needing. And I think this is going to be really overpowered for some of the spawners and stuff I'm going to be setting up in future videos. For now, let's go ahead and head over to one of the warps, which is actually the money-making method of today's video. So I'll bring you guys right back in just one second. All right, guys, so we've gone ahead and done slash warp. We're here at the beach island already. And in order to be ranking up in these slash warps, for example, to the jungle thing, I'm going to be needing to actually mine here and make just a teeny tiny bit of money. So as you guys can see from mining just like this, I get actual coins. And I get a lot of coins, plus I get money, plus I get artifacts, which are actually amazing. With these artifacts, I'm pretty sure I can get really awesome custom stuff. And you guys already know what I can do with money. I can get spawners and all that sort of stuff. I'm actually not sure on what you can do with coins. I think we'll give that a look right now. So this slash coin shop. All right, I can't do that. Slash coins, maybe? Space in it. All right, here we go. In the pirate shop with um, pirate artifacts and stuff, I can be making a cutlass. I can get chest plates. I can get a literal loot box. I can be getting combat tokens. Just a bunch of really good stuff. In the jungle shop, of course, this upgrades to even better stuff. But I think we're going to have to grind here for a little bit before we do go ahead and head into that. I have no clue how I'm making so much money. I think somebody might be paying me. I'm not completely sure. Or I'm just getting absolutely, like really really lucky with what i'm actually gaining on the server but yeah let's run a quick little time lapse of me mining until we have around i don't know seventy five thousand dollars so let's go ahead and run it And holy smokes, we now have $210,000. Turns out, I guess you receive large amounts of money. For example, 135,000 coins. Like dollars, my apologies. In literally no time, which is really, really crazy to think about. I really appreciate the guys over on the server for hooking us up with that. Let's go in and actually open this money case. We got around $14,000. Let's open these coin thingies. We're not getting that many coins right now. And let's see if we can actually spend any of these coins on some things now, okay? Maybe coin shop. Let's go ahead and purchase ourselves maybe a corrupt key. That that should be really good. All right, now we have two corrupt keys. Let's go to slash worm crates. Let's go ahead and actually open both of these. Um, first one, we got 150k, which I'll take any day of the week. And let's see what we get from the second one, guys. We got 2,500 coins. I can't really re-roll it. So we'll go ahead and accept that too. So after only a couple minutes of grinding, I was able to actually get around $400,000. Plus, I have 5,000 coins to my name still, which I'm actually really proud of. So let's go ahead and head back to the island and see if we can put this money to use and see if we can set up anything that's kind of cool. All right, turns out, guys, that these spawners are super expensive. Okay, my money just got updated again. It seems to me the only thing that I can really afford right now would actually be zombie spawners. And I'm guessing they're not really that great. If I go into farming right now, I think it should be in the next page or maybe here. I don't know. I'm guessing they don't sell for too much money. I feel like they'd only be really useful if you have a bunch of them. I don't know, maybe a couple stacks of them or something, and you're AFKing them overnight. But for right now, with the amount of money I have, I really don't think it's worth it. I think it's best if I actually just grind up to, I don't know, 5 to $10 million, and then I'll be able to invest into some of the bigger spawners, such as, as you guys can see right here, Villager, which is possibly Iron Golems if I get $25 million, which is going to be in a while. I got some big brain things to do, all right? I think I got to go ahead and set up just your classic uh, mining thing, all right? I got to be making that money. Ores are a really good way of making money. I think this is how you make it. Did I do it correctly, guys? Am I doing it correctly? I don't... I don't think I did it correctly. Is the server lagging? I think the server just lagged out. What the hell? Did okay, 
I'm I'm very confused on what just happened to the server. Is there just like a block of lava here now? What if I do that? Okay, there we go. Does lava not flow in the server? It does. Okay, I guess you just can't make lava generators right now. That's whatever, right? Besides the point. So let's go back into grinding some more money since that's really my main objective. Since this is only the first video on here. And as I said, I'm going to be showing you guys some good money making methods. Alright, heading back to the beach island, the pirate cavern. Down here is the pirate cavern. Be careful, there are dangerous creatures lurking around. I literally only have a starter sword, so I'm kind of afraid, and I don't think that it's the smartest decision for us to go down there already. Maybe after I purchase some items, I don't know where I can actually go ahead and get them from. Um, yeah, I really don't know. I don't think they sell armor on here. Maybe on the slash AH people might be selling it. Oh yeah, like this starter sword for a million. It has some really good enchants. Might give that a shot. Or even this may act as 50 million, but it has sharpness 6. Okay, seems like I'm doing something wrong in terms of the money. But at the end of the day, it's only my first like hour on the server, so I don't care too much about it. Maybe in the next video, we can actually purchase one of those May Axes or get given like a monthly crate or I might purchase one myself and we'll see if we can get a really good item to go ahead and PvP against other players. But let's go back straight into grinding right here. This kind of gives me a cosmic prison sort of vibe. If you guys have ever played that when you were smaller or still play it right now, if you guys use your pickaxes and just buy mining like the normal coal, um, you upgrade and stuff. I really like how they've gone for like a unique sort of thing on the server. Um, I, I like it a lot, all right? I'm liking it so far. But yeah, I think that's where we're going to go ahead and wrap up the first episode here on play.vanitymc.co. I really hope you guys do go ahead and hop on the server and join me on my journey since I'm super excited to be recording here. And yeah, with all of that out of the way, I guess I'll go ahead and catch you guys back in the next episode, possibly a Hypixel Skyblock money-making method, a prisons video, or maybe a video on here. Have a great rest of your day, and make sure to stay safe, everyone. Peace out.